Today we look at Ezekiel chapter 26 and God is having Ezekiel prophesy to the city of Tyre. Tyre is a Phoenician city that had grown strong and proud. They had uh, accumulated much wealth being sort of a, a city of trade and um, they had begun to ridicule Jerusalem. They had begun to take advantage of Jerusalem's weaknesses and to, to laugh and scorn at the fact that they had suffered in some ways. And so God says Ezekiel prophesy against Tyre. And listen to what he says. He says, therefore, thus says the Lord God, behold, I'm against you, O Tyre, and will cause many nations to come against you as the sea causes its waves to come up. In other words, you're gonna get pounded like waves pound the seashore. God always resists the proud and gives grace to the humble. And they had become so proud and so self-assertive and at the same time wanting to take advantage of God's people. I wanna just read something, I think this is appropriate, that, that Jesus says to a group of people sort of in a way of judgment and in a way of commendation in Matthew chapter 25. It has to do with the end times and judging people for what they do and what they don't do. And he says, the king will say to those on his right hand, come, you're blessed of my father, inherit the kingdom prepared for you from the foundation of the world. And then he says this, I was hungry, you gave me food. I was thirsty, you gave me drink. I was stranger, you took me in. I was naked, you clothed me. I was sick, you visited me. I was in prison and you came to me. And then the righteous will answer and say, Lord, when did we see you hungry or thirsty or give you drink or a stranger or in prison, all those different things? And the Lord responds, well, when you did it unto the least of these, you did it unto me. And Tyre is just the opposite, this Phoenician city. At this time, Jerusalem was in prison. They, they were hungry, they were naked, so to speak, and they were in need. And instead of helping their neighbors, instead of assisting them, they turned their back on them and tried to benefit from them. There's a great principle, even though Ezekiel chapter 26 is very harsh. The principle is when, when you're succeeding and others are failing or they're having difficult times, don't turn your back. Don't become proud. Don't become haughty. Don't become self-sufficient. God resists the proud and he always gives grace to the humble. Tyre is a great reminder of always being aware that promotion really comes from the Lord, not from self.